I did a quick inspection. Arsenal Gear's security system is similar to the antibiotic function of a living creature's immune system. Surveillance of the inner system is handled by periodic scans, using a number of agents with the capacity for detecting data that doesn't belong in the system. Once the agents detect any invading data, the information is passed on to an antibody production system. From there, a program, referred to as an antibody agent, is autonomously produced to neutralize or eliminate the invading data. Added to that, there's a solid barrier existing between GW's optic neural net, its physical and logical base, and the other general nets. Referred to as the bit-brain barrier, this wall is a filtering system for preventing the infiltration of foreign data. This security system makes it very difficult to attack the system from the outside. I'm afraid nothing can be done without sufficient preparation. Raiden, I asked EE e. about the disk you have in your possession. Basically, it's a set of computer worm programs. Each worm is structured to mimic the data units that compose GW. As a result, GW scan agents are unable to detect the program. In short, the program doesn't trigger GW's antibody production system. What's more, the program can penetrate the bit-brain barrier that surrounds GW. Once the worm program enters the neural net, it transforms the surrounding neurons. The transformed neurons become solid and can no longer function as neural nets. As time passes, the neurons transform and perish, stripping the overall system of its power to define and comprehend data. This in turn causes language disorder and memory loss, leading to the shutdown of functions as the system becomes unable to maintain itself. 